Welcome to the Storage Network and Industry Association. We are happy that you've decided to join our community and look forward to your valued participation and contribution in helping SNEA to be the globally recognized and trusted authority for storage leadership, standards, and technology expertise. SNEA is involved in a lot of different technologies around storage, from cloud storage, data security, data management, physical storage, including the new computational storage, persistent memory, power efficiency measurement, including our new SNEA Emerald Power Efficiency, which is now an ISO standard, next generation data center technologies, network storage, and storage management. SNEA is a global organization. At a glance, SNEA consists of 185 industry-leading organizations and companies, 2,000 active contributing members, and over 50,000 IT end users and storage pros worldwide. Learn more at snea.org slash technical. This video is part of the SNEA membership training series. This is the general membership training, a prerequisite for all the other training videos that we have. We have a technical workgroup participant training. We have a primary representative training video. We have a technical workgroup leadership training. And we have upcoming in the near future, we will have a forum initiative and committee training video. These are all important videos on learning about SNEA and how to maximize your benefits inside SNEA while you participate. Topics covered in this presentation is the SNEA organization, technical work, our global presence, an important topic which is maximizing your SNEA membership benefits, and key SNEA resources that are available to you. The organization. One of the most important aspects of the SNEA organizations are technical work groups. They drive in sto important storage specifications, such as the non-volatile memory programming model, the object drive IP-based management specification, SNEA Emerald, which is our power efficiency measurement specification. Uh, we have the solid state storage performance test spec, uh, LTFS, which is the linear tape file system, and quite a few other ones. One of the new ones we're driving now is the computational storage architecture and programming model, a brand new hot emerging technology that is just coming to market. SNEA's vision and mission. SNEA's vision statement is to be the globally recognized and trusted authority for storage leadership, standards, and technology expertise. Our mission statement is to lead the storage industry worldwide in developing and promoting vendor-neutral architectures, standards, and educational services to facilitate the efficient management and movement and security of information. The SNEA Board of Directors maintains the legal and fiduciary responsibility for the association. The SNEA Board is charged with oversight of the organization's vision and mission and ensures that tangible value occurs to member companies. For, for more information and to see who is currently on our SNEA board, visit http colon slash slash snea.org slash board. The SNEA Technical Council is a select group of industry experts who guide the SNEA's technical efforts, oversee SNEA technical work groups, review architecture submitted by work groups, and is SNEA's technical liaison to official standards organizations. It consists of nine voting TC members, of which seven SNEA elected members and two are appointed by the SNEA board. There are also seven non-voting TC advisors. Six are appointed by the SNEA board and one is the technical council managing director. For more details and to see who is currently on the SNEA technical council, go to http colon slash slash snia.org slash tc. Now we'll talk about the SNEA groups. The groups inside SNEA are different types. There's forums, initiatives, technical work groups, technology affiliates, committees, and regional groups. The SNEA technology community forums focus primarily on technology promotion and technical marketing activities and are not associated with a technical work group. We'll, for example, one of our forums we have is focused on networking storage. An additional fee is required to join a technology community forum. For more information or details, please visit snea.org forums. 
SNEA Technology Community Initiatives. SNEA initiatives primarily focus on technology promotion and technical marketing activities that support a technical work group. Initiatives include inside SNEA the Cloud Storage Technologies Initiative, Green Storage, Solid State, and Storage Management. Only initiatives can direct fiscal resources to support and accelerate development of technologies and specifications. There is an additional fee to join a SNEA Technology Community Initiative. For more details, visit http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash forums. SNEA's Technical Work Technical work groups are collaborative technical groups that work on specific areas of technology development. This is where our volunteers collaborate to develop technical solutions to promote the adoption of storage networking by creating deliverables to meet the goals of the Technical Council as managed by the Technical Director. A TWIG's, or TWG, sometimes referred to as a TWIG's, main focus is to develop standards that enable interoperability solutions to be more easily produced in the industry. Selectively developed open source reference implementations and tools with BSD licensing for derivative works and supplemented efforts by non stand members contributors with a CLA. So we can develop open source software inside the SNA, a great opportunity that also includes software for technical specifications that we have developed. There is no additional fee to join a technical work group. For more information, please visit http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash tech underscore activities. There are very many benefits to participate in technical work groups. Actively advance the development and adoption of specific standards-based technology. By participating, you are advancing the development and adoption of standards that will help your company's products as well as the industry in general. Your intellectual property is protected and or monetized with RAND if it does end up in the specification. You can gain detailed knowledge of the standard being developed and influence the standard to address your market requirements. Make sure the product that you are developing features are supported by the standard by participating in the development of the standard. You can also help you identify interoperability issues by participating in the technical work group, issues that may need to be developed and uh, addressed inside the technical work group. Develop solutions for interoperability. Become an industry recognized expert. The fastest way to become an expert is through participation by, not just by reading the standard after it comes out. If you participate in the development of the standard, you will understand how and why every feature in the specification was put in there and will help you develop a better product based upon the standard. We also have a technology affiliate membership. It's a special category inside the SNIA. TA or technology affiliate technical work groups are chartered with developing technical specifications with fiscal resources at a reduced membership fee. They develop standards with a hybrid of both technical work group and technology initiative. Uh, we have uh, right now we have a technical affiliate called the SFF uh, TA TWG which stands for technology affiliate technical work group and they are developing standards around um, connectors, physical connectors and transceivers. Committees. Committees are charted with directing and managing activities of the organization that are not exclusively engaged in developing technical work. Our committees include the Data Protection and Privacy Committee, Education, Interoperability, Marketing Operations, Marketing Steering, Standards, Strategic Alliances Committee. And as a SNEA member, you can get involved and help in any of these committees you would like to participate in. Activities include participating in educational industry events, uh, delivering presentations and webcasts, writing technical articles and white papers, developing multi-vendor interoperability demonstrations of current and future storage technologies, and creating an extensive list of educational resources and information about storage networking. There is no additional fee to join a SNEA committee. For more information, please visit www.snea.org slash about slash organization slash committee. SNEA is a worldwide organization. 
We have regional groups that act as a regional marketing organization that develops local activities in support of the SNEA corporate global mission. Types of regional groups that we have are affiliate, committee, and community. Additional fees may apply to join a regional group. For more information and the full list of regional groups, please visit http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash international. Now this is the most important part of this presentation, maximizing your SNEA membership. What you can do to help maximize the benefits you get from being a SNEA member. There are very many SNEA educational opportunities. We develop tutorials, which are technical presentations for peer review that once approved will be made available for use within the tutorial library. We create and uh, do webcasts. We create technical white papers, contributed articles. You can also join the SNEA Education Committee. There is no additional fee. Please visit www.snea.org education. SNEA Sponsorship Opportunities. The SNEA Dictionary is the storage networking industry's most comprehensive effort to arrive at a common body of terminology for storage-related technologies. It's available in print and, on, and online in a searchable database. Definitions of 2,000 plus storage networking terms are in the dictionary. And the other thing the dictionary allows you to do, as you're writing blog articles or anything online like that, you can actually link directly to the definition from your own online material using our permanent links for each term in the dictionary. A great opportunity to help explain the terms that you do use in your blog post. It's updated as needed during the year and it's an authoritative industry use. Download it at http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash dictionary. The Storage Developer Conference is our premier event that we do every year. It was created by developers for developers since 1998. It's a great educational event for all your engineers with four days of technical sessions and five days of interoperability labs. Every SNEA member company would benefit by sending at least one engineer to SDC. I highly stress this. Take a look at the past presentations that are online and check them out. We always, in the last couple of years, have been recording the videos of all the presentations. Your engineers that are developing your storage products will greatly benefit from what the material that is presented at this event. But the best thing to do is make sure you send engineers there because well, actually one of the best tracks that takes place at the SDC is the hallway track where you get to talk to other members of the organization and the speakers directly. Take advantage of SNEA member discounts including team discounts and send your uh, whole team to the event. There's also great speaking and sponsorship opportunities. Uh, see www.snea.org slash SDC. Contact membership services for further details at membership at SNEA.org. SNEA member events. SNEA holds several different member events during the year. At the beginning of the year, we hold our annual member symposium. It is the annual face-to-face -face meetings of all SNEA groups. We have keynote speakers. We hold birds of a feather sessions on important industry topics. Co-locate special events and industry stakeholder meetings, for example, the Persistent Memory Summit yearly awards and recognition program, and it takes place every January in the heart of Silicon Valley. We also hold technical symposia. These are face-to-face -face working meetings of technical work groups. We hold three of these per year in various locations. This provides face-to-face -face meeting time for technical work groups that need that extra time for the specifications they are developing. There are several different leadership opportunities within the SNIA, and I hope you take advantage of them. You can become an industry expert in the field of your choice. There are leadership opportunities in leading the storage industry by being a member of the board of directors. Uh, you can help drive the technology by being a member of the technical council, a uh, technical work group chair, a forum initiative or committee chair or co-chair. And you can collaborate cross-industry through participating in our alliances program. Utilize SNEA to bring new standards to market. Broader industry collaboration and messaging. Eliminate startup time and resources required for starting up new orgs and standards. So if you have something that you want to bring to market as far as a standard or that you want to finish and complete and develop, 
SNIA is a great way to do that and bring it into SNIA and we can set up a new group to help you actually accomplish your goals. The SNIA Technology Center in Colorado Springs is a facility where SNIA holds meetings and plug fest. It also has a small data center where SNIA hosts equipment used by several SNIA programs such as SMI. SNIA members who donate equipment to the Technology Center for use by SNIA programs get visibility and recognition for their generosity. The SNEA Technology Center also provides hosting services and the use of private meeting rooms to SNEA members for their own use. The SNIA has built a strong alliances program, one that establishes collaborative working relationships with other industry associations to increase the level of integrated storage solutions in general business and IT environments. The SNIA currently has formal strategic alliances with organizations such as the DMTF, Fiber Channel Industry Association, FCIA, MVM Express, Open and Open Fabric Alliance. For more information, please visit http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash about slash alliances. Additional resources that will help you as a SNEA member. One of the first things you hear when you become a SNEA member is all these acronyms and what do they mean? Well, here are just a few of them. TC, I've already kind of mentioned to you, is, which stands for Technical Council. SMI stands for our Storage Management Initiative. The SSSI is our Solid State Storage Initiative. NSF is Networking Storage Forum. CSTI is the Cloud Storage Technology Initiative. TWG, which I've talked to you about before, is a technical work group. TA stands for Technology Affiliate. RA is our Regional Affiliate. Causeway is our SNEA intranet. It is our provider of our intranet of our members only website. F and I's or F slash I's are basically forms and initiatives. And CLA, Contributor License Agreement, is an agreement that people that are outside SNEA agree to who want to participate in our open source projects. SNEA support team. SNEA has staff that are full time focused on supporting you as a SNEA member. Your main support contacts include Michael Oros, our Executive Director, Michael Milidi, who's our Business Operations, and Aaron Weiner and Marty Fulton, which handle membership, Kelly Martin handles Business Services and Accounting, and Arnold Jones handles our technical programs. For more information, please visit http colon slash slash www.snea.org slash staff. And this is a list of SNEA hot links that are very useful and beneficial. And I won't read them to you, but they are going to be available in the hard copy of this presentation. And it will help you find very important information that is on the SNEA website. One I do want to point out, which is a very useful link, is the snea.org slash dictionary. That's something that if you, while you're inside SNEA and you're not sure about a term, that's the place to go to look it up. Before we go here, some of the other key things that are very beneficial to your SNEA membership that will help you maximize your benefits is that you can form a new form or initiative if you have an idea for one. It only requires a minimum of five member companies committed to actively participating. So all you have to do is share your idea with five other SNEA member companies and convince them that this is a worthwhile idea and you would like to form a new form or initiative. Then all you got to do is prepare a proposal that includes a draft charter, name of the group you want to form, a proposed budget, a funding plan, and a calendar of objectives. It needs to be reviewed and approved by SNEA board, which is what you do use with the proposal that you developed. Full details on the process are located here, which is in section 12 of the SNEA policies and procedures document. The best way to proceed, start by contacting the SNEA directive, executive director by emailing ed at snea.org. Another way to maximize your benefits is create a new technical work group. Do you have an idea for a new technical standard or proprietary standard that we'd like to standardize? And this is not just standardized as an industry standard. Through the SNIA, you can take the standard that we develop all the way to ISO and have it become an international standard, an ISO standard. All you have to do is find two other SNEA companies that agree with you. You know, statements of support from at least three active SNEA member companies are a prerequisite for technical work group approval. 
Support includes intent to actively participate in the technical work group. So as long as you can find a, your, your company and two other companies that agree that it's a good idea and they will actively participate in the development of the work you want to do, you have the, met the requirements. All then all you have to do is create a proposal and present it to the technical council for review and approval. It, basically, this involves preparing a draft charter and a pro, proposed program of work. Complete details are located in the guidelines for the approval of SNEA technical work groups. Need any help with the process? Just send an email to tcmd at SNEA.org. SNEA has several governing documents, but two of the most important are the SNEA bylaws and SNEA policies and procedures. Please make sure you check out Section 18, Standards of Conduct, and Section 23, Antitrust guidelines, which are located in the SNEA policies and procedures document, they are available at http colon www.sneaorg about slash corporate underscore info slash documents. Also, please make sure you check out the SNEA intellectual property policy. It's located at http colon slash slash www.sneaorg about slash corporate underscore info slash ip underscore policy. Thank you. If you have any feedback and or questions, please contact Arnold Jones at arnold.jones at snea.org. And make sure you check out the other video presentations that we have available, including the Twig Participant Training, the Primary Representative Training, and so forth. Again, if you have questions, don't hesitate to ask. We're always there to support you and help you with your SNEA membership.